Hey, this is Jonathan Gadget, and I'm here with the Chromebook Pixel, Google's latest Chromebook, and it's a little bit different than the regular Chromebooks you've seen from, uh, from Acer and Samsung. This one is built in, built and designed in-house by Google, and it's also a touchscreen notebook. Uh, the screen is a very big deal, not just the fact that it's touch, but it's high-resolution display. This is a 12-inch display with a 3 by 2 aspect ratio, and it's 1260 by 1700, or uh, 239 PPI. It's a very bright, very beautiful 400-nit screen, and it's got extremely wide viewing angles. We unfortunately don't have any pictures on this demo that they've sent us, but if you close this window, you can see it's very detailed. You can see the grains in the sand. It's, uh, it's, it's just gorgeous display, one of the nicest displays we've seen on the laptop. And Google says it is, in fact, the highest resolution display uh, on a consumer laptop on the market right now anyway. Um, there's a little more to it. It's, it's very nice, thin design. You can see it's got kind of a little dip here, a lot like the MacBook Pro. It's very nice, large, very responsive touchpad. Keyboard's pretty comfortable too. On the right-hand side, you have a, uh, a media card reader. And on the other side, you have the uh, standard USB ports. It looks like they're just normal USB 2.0, not 3.0. A headphone jack, and of course a display port there, and power. Pretty standard stuff. Uh, so far, we don't know a lot. It's, it's uh, going for uh, $12.99 to start. And, uh, and then there's a more expensive LTE version coming out. That's for Wi-Fi only. Uh, it is also the first LTE Chromebook, and so that's also pretty exciting. Uh, very sleek design, very nice, and a great start to a premium uh, Core i5 uh, Chromebook.